Hey everybody, Eddie here. Welcome back to another video. Today we're playing Pokemon Black, Blaze Black 2. Uh, I need to get used to saying the the title of the game so I don't mess it up every time. Route 19. So in the last episode, we got pretty much just the start of stuff done. We have a Pokemon, we have an Oshawott, as you can see on the overlay. Let's see what Bianca has to say for herself. Hey, this way. She's going to show us how to catch Pokemon. This kind of reminds me of that day on Route 1. Okay, here's how it works. The Pokedex pages fill up automatically when you meet Pokemon. Yada, yada, yada. I'm gonna sort of skip through this stuff, just because, um, for the most part, it's just like tutorial stuff, and I have um, played Pokemon games before. A wild Purloin appeared, that's pretty dope, actually. Don't think I'll catch it, though. And she has a lily pup, so she is gonna. She's gonna, she's gonna thump it. You'll pay for what you did to my father! Not father, partner. That was, <laughs> that was supposed to be a bit of a callback, but I've. <laughs> okay, listen. I'm human too. We all make mistakes. Oh, she's gonna throw a ball. Oh, did she hit it twice or did she just do a lot of fucking damage? I guess it's only a level two. Um, Bianca, did you know your Pokemon's a, a level lower than mine? So, um, hey, you need some assistance there? Just let me know. Just call me over if you need any help. Do 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 do. Dude, I like this music. Do 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 do. Oh yeah, fuck yeah, bud. She's in there. Oh, you've got to nickname it! It's in the rules! What a relief, I caught a Pokemon. Oh, um, right, I'll go over the important stuff first. Go find a healthy Pokemon to catch, you'll need to remember this next bit. It's best to lower the HP. You can make it asleep or paralyze it, and then, um, throw your, um, your thingy at it. Meet lots of Pokemon and catch them, okay? Oh, she's going, she's going back. Where are you going? Your, your home's this way. Right, well, here we go. Ah! Okay, we made it. I guess we're on our way then, so that's surfable. The game is very nice looking. Trainer tips. Make an effort to talk to all the people you meet on your journey. Turns out they have something useful to tell you. Hey, I've been told you got something useful to tell me. No, what? I'm such a Pokemon in the tall grass. That's right. If you don't want to meet Pokemon, avoid the tall grass. Shit. Also, um, I'm assuming that the whole the rule with um, running is the same about if you run, you're more likely to get an encounter. Starly's pretty cool. Um, obviously at some point we will need some sort of flying Pokemon. Oh, the rule, by the way, I mean, if you've read the rules, then obviously it says, um, with H HM Slayers being an exception. Hey, you know about ledge jumping, yeah? Oh, I guess you wouldn't know. You can jump all these little ledges. Uh, I mean, I said, yeah. A potion, sweet. That's not bad. Pretty standard thing to pick up on the first route. So, for the most part, now, we're just going to go for a bit of a walk. Route 19, doesn't say where it's leading. Oh, shit. <laughs> you there! My name is Alder, that's a cool name. I'm a trainer with a keen interest in the world. One of my goals is to tell people about how wonderful it is to walk toward the future together with Pokemon. Jesus! He's like, ah, oh, shit, my leg! And you are, hmm, so you're Vamp from Aspersia City. <laughs> from, like, just around the corner. Um. Oshwat, get the pepper spray ready. Oshwat is a fine looking Pokemon, but you're not exactly a seasoned trainer yet. I mean,. I've had my trainer for all of about five minutes. My trainer? My Pokemon? I've had my trainers even shorter, my running shoes. Indeed, I'll train you a little, follow me. Why are people forcing me into help? I don't need your help. Ooh. Flossacy Town. Flockacy Town? Wait, bring it back up. I want to reread that. I think it's like Flockacy Town, because there's two C's. Um. Oh, that's right. Vamp, your Pokemon well, your Pokemon are always doing their best for you, the trainer. So you must. Always be kind to them. My house is just a little farther. Stop by the Pokemon Center. Ooh, do I actually need to? And guy has a point. Um, go ahead and open this up. Pokemon. <laughs> Pokemon. It's like the leading up of the PK crew. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of people to talk to. I'm gonna talk to people just because I haven't played this game before. In the mor in the morning, my Pokemon come to wake me up when they're hungry. At night, my Pokemon get tired from playing and take up the whole bed. Oh, it fills, it fills me with so much joy. <laughs> that guy. That effing guy. Hello! I always save a record of my adventure so I don't forget what I've done so far. It's a good idea for any trainer. Lovely looking houses. Hey, I just walked into your house. On a sunny day, my Petros fur gets all fluffy. I can't help but wanting to pet it. Skuar. The biggest city. Uh, I want to take a ship from Verbank and go play there. Even if you have a lot of them, items never weigh you down, eh? Oh, so that's just saying like there's no weight limit. 
Uh, items in your bag are automatically sorted by type. Okay, I know how bags work, so that's fine. This is just like tutorial land town. Well, I just got a potion for talking to that guy, so I probably should keep um, keep giving them a little bit of a talk. There's a lily pop. Yep, I like that. I don't really know much about Pokemon types and stuff like that. I just focus on raising one Pokemon and charge ahead. It's kind of hard way to do things when I run into a Pokemon that mine is not good against. I can't win anymore. Unless you're um, the world's dopest trainer like I am. As I wandered in search of Pokemon, people began making homes in more places. This ranch used to be a grassy meadow. It's now become a place where people and Pokemon have homes together. Well, you know, we we did destroy your in, an entire environment, but got some nice looking houses. Okay, random timber. Is there anything in this bin? Fresh can is empty. I wonder if that's like pseudo random. Oh, I don't want to talk to you yet. What is that's a clock tower? Are you happy you're able to train a Pokemon? Yes. Right, me too. If I said no, she thinks you go to call call the NSPCA. Or is that the child abuse people? No, it's the NSPCC. <laughs> people always think the past or future would be so powerful. But the great time we're spending with Pokemon is right now. Damn straight, that is a good life lesson to live by. Have I talked to you yet? Hey, want to know what Old taught me? I mean, yeah, let me know what, what I've got ahead of me. He said the Pokemon you throw out at the start of the battle is the one in the upper left slot of your party. Oh, fuck. Shit, I already know. Hey, this way, shall we start training? How come I get, like, yes and no options for, like, everything? Do you want a Pokedex? Do you want a Pokemon? But do you want to do some training? I have to do. By the way, why are you holding two town maps? Why is everyone looking through a bag? <laughs> oh, ho. Oh, it's gone. Your friend is the one with the Snivy, isn't he? Uh, just happens to have trained his Pokemon around 20. Well, if that's the case, you should go give him the town map first. I'm gonna run while I have a chance. I'm never coming back. Just follow this road, it goes to 20. Okay. Uh, you see Flossy Ranch? A wild Pokemon might surprise you. At times like that, only your Pokemon can help you out. Can I go in here? Oh, it's a garage. Okay. The cars and shit. I feel like these like really short walks. This is a trainer battle, isn't it? Ooh. Oh, shit. There are definitely secrets around here. I don't believe that there aren't any secrets here. I'll come back. There's got to be some in that hole. I can, I can, oh, you can like just see that it's like slightly darker. Okay. So I guess I have to fight this guy. Hey, what's up? Uh, you can tell me how much your opponent wants to fight by looking into his or her eyes, don't you think? Oh, that's like a that's a bit of a cryptic guide. You're challenging my youngster Terrell. Terrell Williams. Take out a Patra. We have uh, we have our Pedro going out, so it's gonna be good. Right, um, tackle. I guess we'll just like keep tackling it. It's the same level as us, so maybe we should have tail whipped it. I yeah, I may tail whip it. Oh, now it's leering us. It's just, it's just gonna keep doing the exact same thing we do, but like mirrored. It, it keeps like putting something in its hand, like a little cookie. I can't tell what it is. Is it its tail? I can't tell. Oh. Well, shit. We just got fucked up. <laughs> the first fucking one. Vamps going to a Pokemon Center. Wow. The first, tr the first fucking dude. The first dude. Oh, it is a good job that I didn't make this. Like, oh, if the Pokemon dies, it's dead. Because we would have lost already. Okay, it's a good job that isn't a rule. Wow. Okay, I just got fucked. Well, that teaches me for. Oh my god, I'm all the way back in Dispersia. Wow. Okay, well, um. Be right Although there. I take it back, I need that training. <laughs> okay, we're back. I, um. Uh, fought, like, one dude so I could level my Pokemon up a bit. Um, hey, let's fight. Pokemon battles begin when eyes meet. That's a rule for trainers. Oh, she's just foreshadowing then. Route 20. Okay, so I need to go all the way around this bridge. So this is basically just, hey, this is a trainer fight. Let's do it. Hey there, what's up? You can tell which opponent wants to fight by looking into his or her eyes, don't you think? Um, no, I actually beg to differ. Walks away. <laughs> right, well this could be interesting. I guess really I should call, catch another Pokemon. But I can't, well I mean I can, but I sort of don't want to have one this early. Or maybe I should at least train. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and tail whip him once. I'm going to tail whip him once. 
bring his HP down. Now we're going to keep an eye on the potions. I think water gun should do more damage, right? Okay, well, let's see how this goes. Um, yeah, that did quite a lot, and then I can finish, you know, finish him off with a tackle. I don't know what his second Pokemon's going to be, so we'll see how that goes. Yeah, I was hoping he wouldn't leer us again, because that would make it a bit easier for his friends to come out. This guy's just like the sacrifice, dude. He's just getting a leer off, so it's easier for his buddy to do some work. Oh, nice, we got level 8, though. Oh, maybe I should have looked at my stats. A Zigzagoon. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. I'm just going to go straight in with a water gun. Yeah, I didn't think we'd outspeed it. Oh, he's going to do a lot of damage to us, though. Oh, nice. Destroyed it. Okay. Oh, okay. We should win this one. Dude, it's the first trainer fight, and I'm already like, oh, yeah, we're going to win it, dude. Let's go. The foe's zigzagoon faded. Oh, well, at least we got the perfect amount of XP. Fucking hell, we're already at level 9, dude. We're going growing rapid. 12 speed, though. That's not great. Wow, I could really tell that you wanted... Okay. I wanted something, apparently. I'm not even going to heal. Right, let's see what's going on down here. No secrets, apparently. Wow, I feel a bit ripped off here. Um, I guess another fight, then? Okay, that's fine. Uh, hey, you. Have you seen my cute Pokemon? Take a look. Oh, how cute. Can I go now? Is that it? Are we done? Oh, no. You want me to kill it, too? Awesome. Three Pokemon... Lady, I only have one. Purloin. Oh, it's level 5. I am slightly terrified. Oshwat Goham. Oh, shit. I wanted to um, tail it. Oh, well. Right, let's see how this does and like, judge by that. Uh, a decent amount. Let's just water gun and hope for the best. Oh, shit. What does that do? Did, did she just like steal some of my shit? Oh my lord, that did quite a lot. Oh, if we survive this fight at least, we should be level 10. Oh, definitely water gun for this one. Ooh, nice. Sand attack, you know what? Fuck it, I can I can deal with a sand attack. At least it's not killing me. Pedro's accuracy fell, and then let's finish it off with a tackle to save some of those precious PPs. Even though we probably won't need them. What is it holding in its hand that it's throwing about? Because it's kind of adorable, but I don't know what it is. It's doing like a little chicken dance, dude. Look at it. Oh, a sun kern. That's interesting. Right, let's definitely tail whip this one, because water gun isn't going to be the best thing in the world. It avoided attack. What a little bitch. Super effective. Okay. Oh, can I not tail whip that? Is that just like a thing? Sun kern, attack rose. Special attack rose. Shit, okay. Well, let's just, like, bash it over the, the few times over the head with our rock thing that we're carrying. Yeah, absorb all you like, you little bitch. You don't see the bar go down. It's, like, 20, and then it does the animation, and then it's 14. We are doing not much damage. Just slightly worrying. Right. It probably won't kill us next attack. It did six last time, so it probably won't kill us this time. Yeah, okay, sweet, we survived. Because I was thinking... Whether it hits us or not, we can still use a potion. Wow, I'm not even level 10. My Pokemon are cute even if they lose. Yeah, well, fuck you. Okay, we can avoid that guy, I'm sure of it. Can't paralyze heal. However, to be safe, let's go ahead and use a potion on our on our fella. Potion, ah, there we go. Use. Sweet. 17 points. We do have Pokemon. I'm going to avoid him for now. I am going to come back and fight the trainers. Just for, like, you know, training and stuff. Ooh, a Lotad. That's interesting. I never really thought Lambre was that great. But that is interesting, though. Interesting enough that I'm going to fight it. Just because I want to be level 10. So why not, right? Okay, Growl. It pretty much has the same intention I do. In that case, let's do one more and hopefully it, like, tackles me or something. Probably knows Absorb, too. Yeah, but it does know Absorb, okay. Lotus actually cute as fuck, dude. Look at that. Look at that cutie. I like it. Don't want to catch it, though. It's a three-chain Pokemon, isn't it? What's this fourth up one? Oh, Luda, Ludicolo, isn't it? Yeah, Ludicolo isn't that great. 
<laughs> it's so cute. I don't think Ludicolo is great anyway. Well, I'm only doing um, two episodes in this recording session, so I'll probably do some research on the Pokemon at some point. And on like the changes and stuff in this game. But I wanted to know. Oh, I saw that one coming right as I fell into it. Sort of the last moment. I found a Pokeball, sweet. Uh, right, don't go back down because I'll have to walk around. Let's see what this guy has to say. Come on, a kid without a single gym badge continuing on past here. Battle with the trainers and Pokemon is in here. In, the, in this area of the battle more. Oh, you're saying, oh, come on, he doesn't even have a gym badge. How's he getting through? Oh, shit. Oh, I'm not allowed to go yet. Oh, wait, I thought he was facing the other. I can't tell which way he's facing. That's his bag, okay. <laughs> he's facing this way, sweet, I get it. So is there another city up here? Flossacy Ranch. Okay. Is my buddy up here? Has this got Pokemon in it? I don't know. Oh, hey, it's Clint. Oh, nice, you've come in to toughen up. Alright, let's see how much stronger you've become. Come at me. Oh, no, I don't have a... I'm not, I'm not ready for a fight. You embodiment of anime. <laughs> I tried to load the... Bulbapedia page for Lotad, and it was just taking ages to load, and then it just died. I said, oh no, the page is dead, kill it. Go, Pedro, go, Pedro. Well, I guess we're doing this fight now, then. We have, like, three or four minutes left of the episode. Um, I'm gonna go with a Tail Whip, and then I'm gonna Water Gun it. Use the Quick Attack, okay. Not much I can do about that. And then, let's go ahead and smack it with a Water Gun. Yeah, you can get as pumped as you want, because you're not going to get any action. You're going to big yourself up just to fall yourself down. Come on, partner, shrug it off. You're stronger than that. Oh, we'll see about that. Not oh, shit. I will literally like one shot us now. We still have a Snivy to worry about, dude. Which probably knows, like, some grass-based move that you can fuck us up with. Right, I, I am 20 down, so I'm going to just do a potion now. Because... I don't think there's like any better time to use it really. Because I'm already 20 down, so you know. If we survive, we'll be level 11, I'm pretty sure. Vine Whip, yeah, that's, that's the move. Yeah, it's been a while, I'm forgetting like everything. Okay, that only did half a potion's worth, so that was probably worth it. So let's go ahead and. Tail Whip. Oh shit. I wanted to save, it didn't work. Save state, rapid, yeah, save state 1. Oh, Shift F1 it is, okay. Shift F1. And I guess F1 just loads it. Sorry, what did it just do? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, it did a little bit of damage though. Oh, Jesus. Oh, did it do like bind or something? Oh, wrap. So you're saying that tackle's my best bet here? Is just tackling it? Oh, it's a level 10, dude. That's slightly terrifying. That did nothing. Holy shit. And it's like slowly killing me. This is tough. Giano didn't lie when he said it was tough. I just defense fell. Let's see what Water Gun actually does here. Not very effective, but it does like pretty much the same as Tackle, except I think his base damage is like slightly higher, so we'll keep doing it, I guess. If I die here, then I'll load and just like do two tail whips or something. I can't tell if it's actually doing more or less than Tackle. Stop, dude! He's playing with me. Defense fell. Pedro, use water gun. Dude, we are going to take it out right this time, dude. Or maybe like in a couple of times. We just need to survive two more and then we'll do it. And a ramberry? Oh no, we like actually can't win this now. Yeah, we can't win this, so... Like, I'm dead. Pretty much is how that went down. Do, 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 do. Menomena. Do, 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 do. Right, okay. So this time I'm gonna play slightly differently. I'm gonna tail whip the shit out of him. Be nice if it could just not wrap us. Right. I don't know what's a good moveset though, because it's just gonna keep leering us. But then we're gonna tail whip it twice. And then Um I'm trying to think. I think tail whipping it. Again is a good bet. We have 15 health. Let's tail whip it one more time and then we'll just smack it with, with some tackles, I guess. I wish the speed up didn't just like actually slow it down. 
<laughs> you know what I mean? I need to just change the settings, I think. I think it's just like on some weird settings. Right. See, now we're already on 10 health, though. So if it wanted to, it could probably fuck us up. I think it's faster than us, too. This is a tough first fight, dude. Holy shit. That did nothing. That did ac that actually did less than before. This is very difficult. I may need to go and like train to like level 14 or something. Which is fine, because I'll end the episode up here and do it off camera, but you know. This is going to be fun. So, these first two episodes basically have taught me that I really need to train. Keep on talking about training for this. Because this is definitely going to be very difficult. And I think that's fine. I'm looking forward to it. And um, it's going to be a bit of a challenge and I'm going to have to keep on talking about training. Ideally, I want to get a second Pokemon pretty soon. So I'm going to look into what Pokemon are around and then decide on what I want. Yeah, there's no way I can do this. Because I've just put like pretty much everything I could put into that guy and he's like on nearly full health. And we're still doing nothing to him. Pretty much, so I don't even know if we can win this without getting some crits. Unless there's like some dope way to play it. They can't be though, this early in the game, there can't be any like underlying strats that I'm not aware of. We're still okay, we can keep going. Uh, I sort of can't though. Yeah, just keep using lay. my defense can't get any lower, just keep doing it. One more dude. Yes, yes, keep doing it. We did it! <laughs> yeah! Whoa, that's a lot of XP. Level 11. Well, a bit of a plus to everything. We learned Water Sport, so Water Gun can do more damage now. Oh my lord, it can't be. How could I have lost? I need to apologize to my partner. Yeah, how could you have lost? How did you lose, dude? I'm still going to train up a bit before the next episode. Anyway, Clint, not bad. Uh, you're thinking about how to bring out your Pokemon strength. I should be able to count on you for backup. What are you doing here anyway, huh? That's our map. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Didn't have to do that. Thanks to you two, we just left and you've already helped me out. Who the fuck are these guys? I thought it was likely around here. You were having a Pokemon battle too? Isn't it nice to be young? Can I have my Pokemon follow me around? Like you have your Lily Pup or Lily Gant or whatever? Lily Gant is a completely different Pokemon. <laughs> Who am I? Lily Gant's like the flower one, isn't she? I'm the owner of this ranch and this is my wife. You should keep your Pokemon healthy and happy, right? Here, I'll give you this. Um, vamp obtained a Soothe Bell. Soothe Bell in the items case, okay. I'm not for you. Cheers. A Soothe Bell will increase the feeling a Pokemon has towards its trainer. Uh, by the way, he didn't see a harder on it. Can't seem to find where it went. Oh, Herdia. Our two Herdia are always together and this is the first time one has wandered off. Oh, it's a Herdia, okay, so I'm a little worried. Are you a little worried? Are you kidding me? Your Pokemon might be lost forever. Whatever, I'll look, Vamp. Help me out. I mean, it's probably not going to be on the ranch. Why did he get so mad? I think it's probably just playing somewhere in the ranch. I wonder. By the way, dear, if your Pokemon get hurt, let me know. I'll make them feel better for you. Ah, oh, thanks. Um, yes, please, actually. Well, this this woman? No, this one. Uh, yes, please. Thanks. Oh, by you'll help me out, you mean you'll, like, let me just sleep? It is definitely in one of these haystacks. I can tell. Or it just isn't. Is that a Mari? Can I have the Mari, please? Oh my god, this place is huge. Did Herdia wander back here somewhere? Let's have a look. I mean, it might have. There's a lady. No, not a trainer battle, please. Don't do this to me. Oh, I haven't seen you before. Do you mind sparring with me? No! <laughs> I have to end the episode. I'm going to wrap this episode up here. I hope you guys enjoyed if you did. Just smash that like button. It really helped me out. And what we're actually going to do is I'm just going to basically save here and then we'll oh Bidoof dude I love Bidoofs and then we'll just start the episode in this fight like I'm literally just gonna go like like this and then we will um start next episode off with a fight thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed a like would be awesome and um my name's Junior and I'll see you guys next time peace peace guys thank you very much for watching peace 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 I just I don't know why I said that twice but I did <laughs> peace peace